If I can help somebody as I travel along, and if I can cheer somebody <laughs> with a word or a song, if I can show somebody they are living living wrong then my living shall not be in vain then my living shall not be in vain the If I can help somebody as I travel, travel along, Lord, then my living shall not be in vain. I encourage everybody in this group today to give all of you that you can possibly give. Um, I'm a mother of four, have six grandbabies, and on last Thursday, when I got up, you know, you hit the floor running because, you know, we have an 11 year old that's in school, have a grandbaby that lives with me, and I have chores and, and responsibilities through the day, and by the time you get your stuff done, it's time to pick them up, and they gotta be fed, they're always hungry, have to get the kid to football practice, the grandbaby to dance practice, and of course you come home and your child has a science project that's due the next day that he can tell you about that night. Yep. And last Thursday, I really just wanted to sit down and cry. I said, Lord, I said, this whole day is gone. And I said, I, I, just, I, I just don't feel like I've had enough time. And I just felt like I was falling apart. And I reminded myself, I said, give every measure that you possibly can. Because there's going to come a winter season in life when nobody's going to ask you to go pick up a science project. <laughs> Nobody's going to ask you to take the kid to dance lesson mm -hmm. because you'll come to a point in your life, perhaps, where your body won't give you the opportunity to do that. Being in nursing, I have seen many people in the winter of their life, and these bodies fail us sometimes. You want to be active as you age and continue to go until the day that they have to put you in the ground. But sometimes these bodies do something different. So while you have the activity of your limbs, you better move <laughs> and you better do all that you can because I watched it with my mom and I've watched it with my patients in the hospital. When your body decides to do something different, that's just it unless the Lord says, speaks otherwise in your life and restores health when your body decides to do something different. And having seen all of that, I am just determined to kick every bit of vitality out of every minute of life that I can possibly get. Amen. <laughs> Amen. Amen.